Okay, so a very quick video on what to do when you've got more than one Google Plus place page listing. Log in with your Gmail account, do a search. Okay, you can see I've got too many. This one I have created. This actually was the one that Google's created as a result of my old Google Places listing. So I want to get rid of that one. So what we do is we go in here, as you can see, there's absolutely nothing there. They've grabbed this from my other one. So I go into the page settings. If you don't actually own the page yourself, you're going to need to claim ownership. Verify it by getting a PIN code sent to your business address and then verifying it and then deleting this. Because I already own the page, I don't want to transfer ownership. I just want to get rid of this page. It's going to ask me to sign in and re-enter, making sure I am who I am. Okay. Yes. Yes. Okay, so now what we're going to do is going to go and have a look at what we have now. So now we have Go Viral Now, and that's what we want. So this is my proper page, and this is the one that I actually want people to be looking at. Okay, so I already managed this page, I hope that helps you. Okay, so if you want a little bit more information or you need to follow it in a step-by-step, -step, here is a list of all of the things that you need to do to get rid of your duplicate Google Places listing. Okay, so I hope this helps. One final thing to remember is you can't get rid of your Google Plus personal profile. You need that partly to be able to have a Google Plus page, but you also need it for your blog authorship and everybody should be using the rel equals author tag so that their Google Plus profile photo can come up in the search results. It makes your blog posts far more clickable and you're far more likely to get a good rank with your blog posts. So again, what we're going to do here is you can type in just my name or my company name and then you, it will come up with my page. Now this is my personal profile page and this is the photo that should be coming up in the search results. This is my website. So again make sure that you have both of those. You need your profile and you need your pages. You can check over here on the same time that this is and now you can see I've lost that other page and that's what I wanted to do.